Alrighty guys, what's going on everybody? My name is Blitzone. Welcome to an awesome Skylanders Giants collection video. Now this was a video that has been in the works for a long, long time. This is a very tedious process and a process that requires a lot of patience and that is the process of collecting all 80 sky stones within the skylanders giants video game so basically today i just wanted to go ahead and show you my sky stones collection which contains all 80 sky stones uh, and basically the way that this works is if you don't know uh, collecting sky stones works in many different ways uh, you have to it's a combination of basically kind of uh, defeating enemies in terms of uh within the particular chapters that you're playing there are challengers uh and once you defeat them in a sky stones game you get rewarded with a sky stone uh some of the other ones that i've purchased have been from uh let's say urek uh then uh the other ones have been from dreadbeard who is of course on the ship at all times on flint ship so when you defeat him uh, you get some sky stones and then majority of the sky stones actually is acquired via defeating enemies multiple times so for example in junkyard isles via defeating Bert multiple times you get a ton of different sky stones um uh, let's say the smoltergeist in uh chapter five i believe defeating him will give you a few different sky stones after defeating him multiple times um so there's a lot of enemies within the game who you have to play multiple 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 times such as Bert. i think i've played Bert over 40 times in sky stones to get all the different sky stones so now that i've blabbered on along and explained how to get most of them let's get into the actual sky stones collection so as you saw i have all 80 here just so to make sure that you guys are like oh well you don't have 80 i counted less or something like that so let's get to it so we've got Droll Lance Master. We've got one, two, three, four. We got four of those guys. We've got the Mohawk Cyclops family. Uh, they come in families. Well, at least when I say family, what I mean is like the that usually a uh, Skystone, as you can see, you'll get like Droll Lance Master, and then you'll get multiple types of each one. So we got the Mohawk Cy uh, Cyclops family, which contains four different members. We've got the Mace Majors, which I believe contains five. Oh, four also. Sorry, it's the Blaster Trolls that have five, or the Derivators. Sorry. Um, then we've got the Dro Archers family, which contains three. We've got the Blaster Trolls, who are three of them. We've got the Chompy Bots, which is uh, basically, I think it's nearly an entirely purchasable uh, family in terms of uh, from Uric shop. So we've got Chompy Bot 9000, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. As you can see, the sixth one is a very, very powerful Sky Stone. Three uh, always. Uh, so three attacks in all uh, four different directions. A very useful Sky Stone. I use it on a regular basis. Definitely an awesome one. We've got Archean Jouster. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. We've got the Inhuman Shield, one, two, three, four, five. We've got the D Riveters, one, two, three, four, five. We got the Jawbreakers, which are very cool looking Sky Stones. And I try to play them just because I love the way uh, that this character looks, but they are unfortunately not that useful. Uh, so we've got Jawbreaker, one, two, three, four, and five. I mean, it, as you can see, five is somewhat useful, but later on against the more challenging opponents he's still a little weak uh, we've got the enfuego chompies which of course introduces kind of the elemental sky stones which of course if you don't know sky stones come in regular form and then they have sometimes they have the abilities attached to them in terms of being able to be of a certain element family so in this case it's the fire element so we've got the enfuego chompies there are three of them we've got the frigid chompies there are three of them as well we've got the spiderlings right here which I believe there are three of them as well. And the third one actually has an element, the air element. So that's cool. We've got another Chompy here, the basic one. Then it changes. Uh, the second Chompy becomes uh, of an element ability as well. So is the third one. We've got the Executioner, which is a very useful uh, Sky Stone. And there's actually an enemy. I forget his name. He is in the third... Uh, the one that you have to save Ermit in. He's in the third chapter. He uses only Executioners. And he is really tough to defeat. Especially at first when you don't have a, a Skystone cheat. Or uh, a good uh, piece to use against him. A good Skystone to use against him. So definitely was a pain in the butt for me at least. Uh, but then uh, I was able to come back and kick his butt easily. Especially when I got Conquertron. Which we'll 
take a look at in just a sec. So then we've got the Archean Duelist. We've got the Bagaboom. Shadow Duke, which is a very cool name and an awesome uh, looking design. The Archean Sniper. The Conquertron. So this is the most powerful Skystone. It is purchased in the store uh, from Eurex. So uh, there it is. That is the most powerful Skystone. It's got four attack on all four directions. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And when he attacks in the Skystone's game, he's so huge. Like his animation is just, he just towers over everyone else. The Archean Bomber, which has an element. The Boulder Bowler, which I believe is kind of a unique thing because I don't think that you actually get to battle a Boulder Bowler within the game itself. So you get the Skystone of him, but you don't get to actually battle a Boulder Bowler. At least I don't recall battling any of these. Let me know in the comment section below if you have. We've got the Boom Fiend, the Armor Chompy. We've got the Life Spell Punk. The Grenade General, the Root Runner, which was a pain in the butt. And this was the last Skystone that I was hunting down. I had 79 and I was like, should I just do the video and just say that that's the one I'm missing? But no, I was just hunting it down, hunting it down. And then finally, I just got it and I had to make this video just because I was so freaking excited to just finally do the video and finally be able to show my Skystone complete collection. Uh, we've got the Trog Wanderer here, the Dragonette. The Crystal Golem, which is a very cool looking Skystone. Unfortunately, it's a little weak. I, th I thought it would be a little stronger than this. At least three attack on all four ways, but unfortunately it wasn't. I really like this creature too. The Blaze Brewer, who is a very cool picture here. We've got the Slobbering Muticus, which is also very, very cool looking. The Archean Crackler. The Archean Shield Juggernaut. The Goliath Dro. Gargantula. Trogmander, and finally to round out the list, number 80, Archean Ultron. So there you have it guys, that is the entire Skystones collection for Skylanders Giants, so basically you can go ahead and use this I guess as a checklist even, uh, use this video to see uh, which Skystones you're missing. And uh, yeah, I'd love to hear in the comment section below which Skystones uh, you have. What is your kind of uh, the deck that you usually use? Do you prefer to use a certain uh, weaker Skystones just because you like their design? Or do you usually stick to just the most powerful Skystones and you just go ahead and use always the Conquertron, the Chompy Bot uh, 9065, uh, like your most powerful uh, creatures? Or do you just sometimes pick to play the weaker creatures just because you like their design or you like to play with those particular characters i'd love to hear that in the comment section below that being said guys if you enjoyed this video please hit that like button that would help me out a ton it took me a long time to hunt all 80 i'd really appreciate if you could hit that like button guys subscribe share the videos and favorite the videos that helps me out as well thanks a lot for watching you guys are freaking awesome i'll catch you guys next time with another skylanders giants or uh other cool gameplay videos so make sure to stay subscribed thanks a lot for watching again Peace out, guys, and I'll see you later.